Hey guys, so as you guys know, this is my natural hair. It's not terrible, but it's a little bit boring. So of course I wanna add some extensions in. I just got these in the mail. They are secret extensions, and they seem to be really easy, so let's test them out. Um, a side note here, definitely make sure you're not wearing a choker as you're trying to apply this, because it's actually very simple to apply to your head, but when you have a choker on, it gets all mixed up, and it's just a little bit chaotic, so don't do that. So basically, I'm just going to put it on my head like it's a headband, and then from there, you just pull your hair out. But you know what I realized? Eh, a brush would be better. So I'm just going to brush my hair out to make sure it all blends in nicely, but seriously, you guys, it's that easy. So I'm just gonna make sure that I have a little bit of volume at the top so that it blends in those little clear elastic headband things. And I mean, this is it. But as you guys know, I mean, this is so simple. Like I had to just do a little something extra, extra for you guys. Oh yeah, and don't mind me. I'm just showing you guys it's really locked in there. You know what I mean? So obviously leave it like this if you want to, or you can do what I'm doing. I figure it's festival time, so why not put a few braids in, kind of get festival inspired. So I'm just going to do some Dutch braids, these thin little things, but I am only pulling one side of my hair. Don't ask me why. I have no rhyme or reason other than I just felt like mm, this is the way I wanted to do it today. But I'm going to just braid my hair all the way down, and honestly, Another tip, if you guys for any reason do feel like your hair is just gonna fly off your head, braiding it and pinning it was just like another secure way of making sure those extensions aren't going anywhere. Even though I can honestly tell you it's really tight on my head and I don't feel insecure, I just thought, well, there's a solution in case you really do. You can just pin it and make sure you pin it to your extension and your real hair and guess what? That stuff is locked in there for good. And then I'm just gonna get the other side, do the exact same thing, braid it down, you know. And I typically like to do messier braids because they're more forgiving. So if I screw up, if I am not doing the perfect Dutch braid, I'm sure maybe you guys will notice, maybe you guys won't. In the finished product, honestly, I don't think you're able to tell. It's really hard for me to braid my own hair. Like, give me someone else's head, I can braid any which way you want. For myself, I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just because I can't see, like I can see braiding someone else's hair, but it's kind of difficult. Let me know if you guys have the same sort of issues as me down below. And then from here, I just decided to be just a little bit extra. You know, I needed to put some flowers in my hair to feel festival inspired. To be honest, you guys, I don't even go to festivals. That's really just not my thing. But I know a lot of people do, some of my friends do. So I'm trying to give them some inspiration here. And once you got that last little flower in, that is it. So let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you guys have tried these extensions. Let me know if you guys have any questions down below. And I will see you guys all next week. Bye.